Yes, let's grab those eggs out of there because they will spoil inside the pen. Oh, by the way, guess what? <laughs> it's time my level 10 chicken fr Oh, we got two level 10 chicken friends. All right, level 10 chicken friends, it's time for both of you to graduate. You guys get to graduate together. So this is your graduation ceremony. Ready? Dun, 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 dun. and gentlemen to subsistence i'm an old guy gaming in in this episode we are going to expand our base we finally 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 have over 300 nails um man it took me a long time to, to get that back um our base is in pretty good shape there's probably a little bit of damage but not too much i think but i certainly wouldn't bet money on this that we'll have one more day before we get attacked again the cycle is a little bit hard for me to it's been a little bit hard for me to read lately. Um, let's grab this since it's right there. Um, yeah, so hopefully, you know, they'll leave us alone today. If they don't, then of course we'll deal with them. But uh, we are going to expand the base. So the goal for this episode is to... Um, do I have those lights off? Yeah. Is to expand our base and also build our greenhouse if we, uh, if we get that far. Okay, so let's go ahead and um, I got this running... Because I also want, I got five ingots there, and I want to make, we need to make one more ingot, because we're going to go all the way to level three with our bow as soon as possible. So let's just make that right now. And then to upgrade the bow, uh, pull that out for a second. So we need 1950 power, and we just hit 200 mass. I have been also uh, feeding stuff into here, but... I ran that for a little bit, too, just to get it all the way up. Okay, so we just have to wait for this to get to 1950, um, and then we'll be able to do our bow upgrade, and we have all the rest of that stuff now. Uh, okay, so let's pull this back out of here. <clears throat> By the way, the the uh, Tier 2 upgraded recurve bow with the premium arrows will one-shot um, all wolves. N not, not like a level 3 white wolf, but all the black wolves. Um, so it's already one shot in, but I want to get it to where we can use the normal arrows. And I, I think once we get this to three with a normal arrow, I think we can one shot a level one wolf. I'm not hundred percent positive about that. We'll have to just see, um, you know, what happens there. Okay. Let's just leave those guys in there for now. We'll put these guys back in here. This is working on iron. So what is our power right now? One eleven in 68 out. Uh, I turned the crop plot lights off. Oh, and by the way, um, I moved the crop plots out here, and this is where we're going to build our greenhouse. And it is also March. So I think this is the second day in March now, I believe. So, yeah, we are finally in the springtime. Yeah, yeah. So let's grab those eggs out of there because they will spoil inside the pen. Oh, by the way, guess what? <laughs> it's time my level 10 chicken fr Oh, we got two level 10 chicken friends. All right, level 10 chicken friends, it's time for both of you to graduate. You guys get to graduate together. So this is your graduation ceremony. Ready? Dun, 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 No, I'm butchering, butchering, butchering the pomp and circumstance song, but something like that. Anyway, okay, so those chickens have now graduated. They've gone to that great level 10 chicken place in the sky, and we can now get all of their giblets and do good stuff with it. Okay, put that back there. Uh, we are at 120 now on our health cap, and in fact, we, can we do this? Ha, 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 we did that. We are now 121. Four more big meals, guys, and then after that, we'll be level capped, and then I'll start eating, me eating medium-sized meals and making that stuff and saving the big meals for um, if we if we bite the dust. Uh, okay, so so here, let's just give this piece of kelp to the 
to the thingy and then it, it'll be in pretty good shape for the next batch of birds once we go out and get those but we're not gonna worry about that today fantastic all right so here we go let's do some building we're gonna grab that stack of nails except for i want to hang on to uh let's hang on to 75 nails for repairing okay and then uh, we'll grab those boards we'll grab the cordage and let's actually make some more cordage too with the fiber that we currently have just so we have plenty of that we have 131 boards so we're doing really good with that stuff and yeah let's get to building all right so the first order of business is we are going to extend uh the interior of our base out to this wall um so the first thing i want to do is i want to get some uh the roof pieces in place uh so let's go ahead and uh, get those going uh, so we want two of the curved roof pieces and then we're going to want let's see one two th three yeah three of the of the of these guys here the slanted roofs one two three uh here let's um actually do that um that'll get the roof pieces in place and then after we do that we'll figure out the next part of this so this wall is going to go, um, we might, mm, we might do, okay, let me think about this for a minute. So we got the, the we're, we're going to have a deck that's, that goes out this way. I don't know if we'll get to that in today's build, but that is the plan. Um, okay, yeah, so let's grab these. want this to go just like that all right anybody coming no nope, it's looking good all right let's go over to this corner here and we want to flip you around this way no uh, this way no this way wait what one more this way but we've got to turn our body this way oh uh, <laughs> there we go okay I was going like what in the world's going on there all right, and then we got the three slanted roof pieces that we'll put up there. Now, um, let's see here. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna push this whole entire wall back. But I might actually do. I might do like two rooms in here. One room for like utility stuff, and we can put the bedroom in there, and then the other room, like the front room. Maybe. Uh, and even if I do do that, that's still temporary because, you know, we're going to have an upper floor where th where that's going to be kind of like the bedroom and the living area and that sort of thing. And we'll make some comfy chairs and some rugs and stuff like that when the time comes. All right. Well, anyway, let's uh, let's get back up here. Okay, so flip this around this way. Put you there. You go there. And you go there. Excellent. 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 Now, um, do we... No, we're going to leave this flat. Yeah, we're going to leave this flat for now. I might... I might patch these up temporarily but eventually that's all going to be covered oh no actually you know what we're going to do with that I, I know exactly what we're going to do with that we're going to take these walls we're going to have to make a new uh, bcu because the bcu is currently attached to this wall uh, uh do i want to do that though i might actually put a glass wall in here I don't know. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's just do it this way for now, so so that way we're we're actually covering it. And uh, we'll might as well just grab these walls and do the same thing. But I might, at a later point in time, 
make these um, half walls. Can we make half wall glass? Yes, we can. Okay. And then we'll put like glass windows looking out that way, which I think will look really cool. All right. And then let's grab this one. We're repurposing the walls. And that could go there. Okay, cool. So we have that part done. Now, um, we have two more walls. So what I'm thinking... What I'm thinking here is... Okay, let's, let's move this stuff first before we do anything with all of this over here. All right, now, so that means we're going to have to... Go, let's go out here and grab this piece here, since it's already made. We're just going to borrow this piece here. All right, can I get it? All right, yeah, that's good enough. <clears throat> oh, can't get around there. Here, actually, let's close that door in case we do get some company. But I can't throw stuff into our yard. Those guys are rude like that, you know. They are rude like that. Okay, and then can I put this... Uh, uh, uh. Go back, go back, go back. There. I just need to get it in here. Okay, now let's pick this up again. And we're going to stick it right here. Oh, that's kind of weird. Okay. If that's what you want to do, then that's what you want to do. Now, let's temporarily borrow this walkway here. Pressing end and not delete. Okay, put it there, and then pick it back up with end, and then we'll stick this up here. Uh, we got to pull it back to us. There we go. All right, nice. Uh, now we are going to put the upper crates up first, or this upper crate anyway. Uh, but it's got to be on this side of the door, of course. And make sure it's straight, and then push it back up against the wall and just until it barely turns blue or red, and we want it right about there-ish. Yeah, that's close enough. Okay. Now, I don't think I can get this one on the, on the edge there, but let's try it anyway. Oh, we can. Okay, good. That's even better. Okay, so make sure we're straight. Push it up to there. Out that way a little bit. And good. All right. Fantastic. Now we don't need this feller anymore, so let's take it back out where it belongs. Then we'll continue moving more stuff. There you go. All right. All good. How are we doing out here? Anybody coming? Nope. We're good. We should also not need this uh, half wall any longer. Can I get it all the way down here? Yeah. There we go. I've debated whether or not to put these half walls um, all the way around but the problem with it is it kind of obstructs my my view from shooting out the window so yeah I don't know I'm, I might not even ultimately keep this even this one here but we're just going to put it back for now okay bring you back and you want to go right there. Is that where we had that? No, that is not where we had that. 
need to move it over just a little bit. To right about here, I think. There we go. That's where we had it. So yeah, it, do, it does help, you know, provide extra protection, a place for me to duck behind when I'm outside, but I can't, you know, shoot it, shoot at them out the window there. So I'm, I'm trying to decide if it's worth it having that there or not. Haven't made that decision yet because it's still there. Cool. Okay, now let's grab these guys. So far, we're still getting by okay with just the four crates. I mean, that'll probably eventually change, but for now, it seems to be working okay. All right, let's make sure that's nice and straight. And we want it right about there. That's pretty good. Perfectly lined up? Yeah, probably not, but pretty close. Just as long as it's not an eyesore. That's the rules. Okay, and then let's put this one here. Make sure it's nice and straight. And about there-ish. Okay, the ones on the bottom are a little bit closer to each other. I'd say this one we could probably actually move over just a Nat's eyebrow. Maybe right about there-ish. That looks pretty good. Now the one on the bottom is a, maybe a little too wide, but you know what? It's close enough. It's good enough. Not an eyesore, so we're good. All right, now, uh, the next thing we want to do is... Uh, we don't need this stove over on this side of the house unless we wind up bringing our crops in again next winter. So I'd rather have them both together so we can just service them both, um, you know, together at the same time. So, um... Why don't we grab you? And how about if we... We could do... Just trying to think about this for a second. All right, let's put one here. The nice thing about this game, as you all know, is that we're, we're not stuck with putting something in a certain spot. We can set it there, and if we don't like it, we move it. Okay. Let's move this one over next to it. Might probably have to set that down and move it again. Okay. And we'll put this one right about here-ish. There we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so this is our kind of a kitchen area. Um, what we could do is have the kitchen. See, this is where I'm thinking about doing the second room. Maybe dividing the place here so that we could have the kitchen along this wall. Uh, all right, so let's let, let's look at that possibility. Let's take this here and put it. You know what? You know what? Though I think I'd rather have this be a doorway so I can run out and look through there. Right. I think I would. Okay. So here, let's let's put that there momentarily. Let's grab this doorway. and stick that right there so we can just run through here you know to look out and get into this other room okay that works um i guess we'll attach the door to it too because i don't have anything else to do with this door at the moment okay now i want to move Let's move you over here just temporarily. Move you over there just temporarily. Now let's grab you. And we'll put you right there. And I think I want this to be yet another doorway.
Just thinking here for a second, just kind of thinking out loud, quietly, <laughs> in a quiet sort of way. All right, you know what? Let's do, 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 do. let's put the stove here. I'm gonna kind of just I'm not gonna think too terribly hard about this because I can always, like I said, change it later. We're not stuck with this positioning. Okay, we'll put this fridge here. Now, I, I'm i pretty sure we will eventually need, want to put in a second fridge. It's not going to happen tomorrow, but eventually we will. So I'm going to leave this area open for that second refrigerator when the, when the day comes to do that. Okay, good. So that takes care of that. Now, what we could do is... What if we moved you... over here alongside the fridge which means I'm taking up that extra spot for the fridge but again we can fix that later kind of like that idea okay good now let's grab you And I'm, um, no, you know, actually, I don't think we're going to, we, we should be fine with one refiner for the whole playthrough, because we can add more slots to this, and I will eventually do that. So that can go there. All right. Now, what if we put our light, take our light, and put it maybe up here. We might end up needing two lights when it's all said and done. But that's okay. Now, let's take this room. Actually, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to do something different here. Let's move Let's just move you somewhere temporarily. That's not where it's going to stay permanently. <clears throat> Excuse me. I want this to be like a utility room where we're going to put some of this machinery that we're not that we don't use frequently. All right, so that means I want a wall. The nice thing about this is that we're not having to build a lot of stuff because we're being able to repurpose some of these pieces, which is great. All right. So, yeah, I got an idea. I got an idea. Uh, we want that wall. Do I have an extra doorway? I don't think I do. I think we want to keep all these doorways. Right? Yeah, we do. Okay. So, let's make another doorway. And we're going to take and put this wall... Uh... Is that facing the right way? Okay. I want it to... Can we get it to attach in the middle of this foundation? Oh, we can't. Hmm. I thought we could. Uh, all right. Well, in that case, I guess it's going to go there. Okay. Now... Uh, let me see here. I was trying to think how I want to do this. This will probably not go there because it's probably blocked. Oh, no, it does go there. But is that right? No, we need to turn it around the other way. Okay. Now, now what we can do is, I didn't really want this door here, so now what we're going to do is we're going to put it in front of the utility room instead. 
Beautiful. Okay, now we gotta fix this. So, um... Um... I think what we're gonna have to do is something like this. Let's grab you. And we're gonna put you... Right there. Too bad you couldn't stack these. You know what, though? We could do the half wall thing that we did with the storage, and I'll bet you we could double stack this. Um, all right, I'll think about that. I don't think we need to. We don't need to do that right now. We'll give that give that one some thought. Okay, so you need to come out to about here so you're not clipping. Right about there. Okay, now let's grab you. And we'll put you right here. And we'll grab you. You just lost a fire. And we need to pull you out just a little bit so you guys are even, otherwise it's going to bug me. These two are actually pretty even. Okay, right about there. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, now... um. I don't often run my second generator, and I only occasionally run this guy. I do use the mass recycler a little bit more frequently. So why don't we put you right here. And let's grab this second Jenny. And we'll put the second Jenny right here. I only run this when I really want to boost the power. I've got a whole bunch of crap going on at the same time. All right, look. This is cool. Check it out. We got a utility room. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, so we got that done. Now, um, I'm trying to decide if I want to... The, be the bed's going to eventually go upstairs when, you know, when we get an upstairs built. Uh, but I'm trying to decide if I want to, um, what, what the heck am I trying to decide? <laughs> I don't remember what I was going to say. Oh yeah, where are we going to put the BCU? So if we, yeah, we're going to have to redo the stairs also. So if we put the BCU over here, I wonder if that would start pulling the hunters more this direction to get at it. I'll bet you it would. Which I don't really want to do. There's an eagle out there. Because it's this end of the base that we've done all the armoring. So what we might want to do with the BCU is just put it right here. I think we should. Yeah, I think we should do that. Okay. Uh, so... Let's make a new one of these. So we need some scrap and some stuff. Some of this and some of this. Okay, let's make one of those. Oh, I was going to keep making uh, more of this too. I'm not so sure I like... Those fire I like I like them there, but I'm thinking I want them closer together. It's just I don't know. Either that or No. Yeah, here. Let's do this. So we're gonna we're gonna hold them in a little bit just so they're closer together. Because I don't know, they just feel like they're a little too spread out for for my liking. Here, let's turn this on. Yeah, we might need 
we might need two lights in here moving forward. We'll see. Uh, where's the edge of that? It's kind of hard to tell. Eh, that's okay, I guess. All right, you got matches. You don't. I'm going to need to make a fire starter to get that guy back. Let's just at least get the one going so we have it also giving us some light. Uh, no, not that. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, so I think we'll put the new BCU either here or here. I'm thinking right here. So we keep the hunters going towards... Uh, oh, you know what? We have to destroy the other one first, don't we? Uh, you know, keep them going in the same direction. Okay, so press and delete. Put the new one up. And we want it right here. We'll make it even with the top of the door. And right about there. Now we need to turn this back on. Okay. This light's kind of in a bad spot because it, it's blocking our kitchen and stuff. What if we take the light and put it up here? Yeah, I, I think we... Oh, crap. In the next few days... Oh, no. They, that just happens when you move the BCU. Yeah, I think... I think we're going to need more than one light in here because we've, you know, we've expanded the space, which is fine, which is fine. Okay. Now, this guy we run 24-7 pretty much, at least until we get more solar panels and stuff like that going. So I guess we could just keep it right here. That's a good enough spot for it, I think. And speaking of which, let's... Turn you back on, and you go back in there. All right, cool. We're making progress, people. We're making progress. Okay, what are we going to do with this thing? Here, let me get this out so we can all see what we're doing here. Why is that orange? Oh, you know why? Because it's no longer in the range of this. Can I pick these up, or do I have to redo these? I can't. Ah, oh, you stupid game. I'll bet you our, our crop plots are no longer in range now. Um. What do we do about that? Are these still growing? Yeah, see, I can't turn them on. Uh, I'm sure they're probably still growing, but they're outside of the... Okay, I'm going to have to fix that. I'm not going to do that right now. I'll figure that out later. Okay, so we have to figure out what we're going to do with this and the bed, but we have a lot of room along the wall here. However, I think we're going to move the stairs to kind of maybe go up along this area here. So let's grab our... A mass recycler and let's see it doesn't really fit nicely right there it might no it's not gonna fit nicely right there either but what we could do is this let's grab you and put you right here because you will fit nicely right here Okay, and then we'll grab you, and put you right about here-ish. Maybe over this way just a little bit. And that's not too bad. That's not too bad. What if we took this light here? Put it up 
Here, let me see some. Oh, man, see, that is just barely out of range, too. Dang it. All right. What if we put you up here? No, there's no two ways about it. We gotta. We need two lights. What do we need to make another light? Uh, 50 mass. Wait. Oh, did we lose all... Of, we lost all of our mass, didn't we, when we moved this dog, gone it? We sure did. Son of a gun. Okay. Here's what it is. All right, now, we're going to grab this guy. And I want it to... Oh, uh, you know what? This is going... We need to make the other kind of stairs. If I want it up against that wall, uh, which I do. Unless we... No, see, that doesn't work very well either because it's just kind of in the way. Is that you know what I think we need to do is we need to just make a friggin uh, hatch then be done with it that's gonna be the cleanest way to do this <coughs> that being said though let's grab this for a second and move it over here Actually, this isn't too bad. This could work. We'll need to put like a half wall in there. That could work. All right, let's grab this bed. And knowing that this is eventually going to go upstairs... Oh, we can't even put it there because it's outside of the range. Okay, you know what? Let's just put it in this corner then. Can I flip it this way? Yeah, okay. No, not that way. This way. All right, bump it up against the wall. Can't tell if it's exactly straight. That's pretty close there. Okay. I mean, that's not terrible. Maybe we'll we'll run with that for now. We'll run with that for now. Okay, so uh, we're gonna want to make a one of these that will stick right in here. Oh, we got to eat. Oh, man, it sucks that we lost all that mass that, <laughs> that I had built up. Ugh. Oh, well. What can you do, right? All right. Now, pull, nope, pull you back to there. Oh, that's, yeah, that's a little jank, isn't it? Um... I mean, it works. You know what? I'm going to leave it the way this way for now because we're eventually going to use a hatch to get upstairs. Uh, well, all right. Hold on. Let's just try and move it over a little bit and see what it does. Okay, so you need to go... No, that way. No, that way. See, the problem with moving it here is then, the, then I'm going to hit my head on the ceiling. does kind of want to go out to there, though, a little bit. It comes out. Well, no, that's still not right. Yeah, nope. We're going to leave it the way it is. I'm not going to fight with it because it's temporary. I'm not going to fight with it. Okay, so that takes care of that. All right, now, what do we have left to do for... In here. That's kind of weird that there's a gap there. I think we just need to put 
a ceiling piece up here. Uh, and we're good to go. Yeah, it's just going to be a flat ceiling piece for now. While we're waiting on that, let's eat. Uh, or no, let's cook up. Uh, let's cook up another roast dinner. So bake. All right. And I think I want you to go this way. Yeah, that. That crack's going to bug me a little bit, maybe. I don't know. Okay, so... Hmm. I think what we're going to need to do here... I wish you could move these. But you can't. You have to re... You have to rebuild the doggone things. So what's it take to make a new extender? gonna take one of our precious ingots but you know what that's what it takes that's what it takes because that's where the crops are going that's where I want my crops and uh, there's just no ifs ands or buts about it okay so yeah let's um let's grab an ingot and what else do you want you want some scrap and a circuit board okay so we're gonna have to make the circuit board grab the scrap oh and some copper Let's get you turned back on. And you're running, right? Yeah, okay. Did we get all the fat out of these guys? Yes, we did. Okay. They're at 81%. Okay, so we got the circuit board. Now, uh, now we just need 80 mass. How much mass do we currently have? 58 all right, I'm just going to turn this on. Let's just get her done. Okay, so while we're waiting for that to happen, um, let's go ahead and get the greenhouse put up really quick. Shouldn't take us too long because I think I... Oh, you know what, though? Doggone it. We're going to need our precious ingots. <laughs> Crap. Uh, no. Okay, well... Let's take our precious ingots and if that's what it takes, that's what it takes. 80, 67. All right. Um, so what we're going to want to do, what do we need? What else do we need? We need glass and adhesive. <coughs> Excuse me. Good Lord. Okay. All the glass and adhesive we have, we have looted. We've never had to make a single piece of that. Uh, but I also have a full stack of sandstone and 25 more, which we have also fully looted. I, well, a couple of those I probably harvested, but not very many. All right, so let's make... Uh, we're going to make need to make a wall. We're going to need to make two walls in the back. Uh, you know what? I might have to rethink this. No, we don't have to rethink this. We'll put a door in the center and then two half walls on, on each side of the door. But for the back, we're going to need this. And we're going to have to make some more ingots too. Okay, we got that mass yet? 85. Oh, now we're... <laughs> damn it. Now we're low on power. Okay, turn that off. Let's run both of these guys. Get that power going. All right, so this wall here. Uh, yeah. This is going to go here. And we are starving, so let's fix that. Okay. 
it's fixed and we are now just almost to 123 on the cap here let's take some some water too all right you ready to go you are fantastic okay let's make that now um how many ingots does that leave us three okay let's go back and get the extender just about done here okay so what we're gonna do with this guy is Oh, really? So, okay, hold on a sec. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, right, right, right. Okay, that's... You know what I'll probably end up doing then is... I'll probably just destroy this one and then add another one that goes out even further. But if we put this one here... Well, let's just put it above the door so it looks better. Because, I mean, I would put it here, but it looks kind of weird right there. This is still going to be closer than the other one was. Okay, good. So that reactivated this one. Um, and we should be back in business now with our crops. But what I'll probably do is I'll probably take the older one down and build another one and maybe see if I can put it out here somewhere to extend it even further. Uh, let's just make sure. Can I turn this on? Yep, that one's good. Can I turn this one on? Yep, that one's good too. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. So, we're going to put this guy here. Oh, what in the hell is that? Did I... Oh, it's a window. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Crap. Okay, well, since we have it, right? Um, where do we want to put our first glass window? I guess we'll put it right here. That's not what I meant to do. But it's been done. Okay, so uh, let's let's just see. What do we need? So, so we're going to need one, two, three more full walls, a door, and two half walls, and then the ceiling pieces. So, okay, that's going to be one. Uh, well, let's make what we currently have in our inventory. Okay, so... We know we need this. I'm going to make this one, and uh, we're out of iron frags. Let's get some iron fragments. And we're also going to need to make some more ingots, too, right? So let's make, like, three more of those. Okay, that goes there. All right, so you're working on the door. Then I want these two pieces for the side. And then we're going to need uh, more of these, too. And it looks like I might have to make some glass. So now the U go right in the center, just like that. Okay, nice. And then U... Go there. Do I need to move that? No, that's actually okay. Where where it is. It's good where it is. You go there. And then we're making another full wall to go here. And if you're wondering why I'm putting the door on that side and not on this side, it's because that's where the stairs are. And, and this is where I gather the water. So I, I could put the stairs going up this way, but then we got all this stone jank stuff in the way. And yeah, so this is the way. Uh, just like the Mandalorian would say, this is the way. Okay, there, we established that. Okay, we got that done. Now uh, we're gonna need th three more pieces in total. And we made three more ingots already, I believe, right? So yes, we did. Oh no, we made two more. 
Why didn't we make three more? I don't know. Let's make three more. Oh, because of mass, probably. Okay. And then uh, to make glass... Where do we make glass? Here. Okay. Grab all of this, which also we looted. And, okay, so we need one more wall, which is this. And we need four more pieces of glass for that. Okay, so, oh, for Pete's sake, we need mass for that. That. <laughs> all right, you know what? Uh, I'm going to cut the camera. I know this has been a long episode, but it's been a fun episode, too. I'm going to cut the camera. Wait till I get enough mass to finish out the greenhouse. We'll finish out the greenhouse, and then we'll wrap up the episode. So I'll be right back. All right, guys, we are back. Um, I want to make these slanted roofs for the greenhouse because I think it's going to look nicer. But I need four of these, and each one requires seven glass and, uh, and, and four more ingots. So what I'm going to do for now is I'm going to put... <clears throat> excuse me, put a flat roof on the greenhouse. Um, and then later on, I'll replace those with the slanted roof and repurpose the flat pieces for something else um, that we'll use. Um, so that's what I decided to do because it's just taken forever. And I, I even went out and cut a bunch of wood and converted all the sticks to feed it into the mass recycler just to get our mass up. Um, so, yeah, that's what we'll do. And, you know, we'll repurpose, like I said, we'll repurpose the two flat glass pieces for something later, you know, uh, as we continue our build. Uh, so they won't go to waste, but it's just, it's this is becoming a little bit more expensive uh, or take, I, it's not, well, yeah, it's expensive too, but it's taking me a little bit longer than I want, want it to. Okay, so let's make those two flat pieces there. And we're going to come out here and take, and put this piece here, whoop, put that piece right there. And then we'll put the two flat pieces in. Oh, we need a door, too. <laughs> Dang it. I forgot about the door. we got to do the door. Uh, that's going to require another ingot and four more pieces of glass. Ugh. Okay. So, uh, yeah, we don't even have enough iron. Oh, no, I got iron on me. Never mind. Okay. So let's do one more ingot there. And then... Uh, one, two, three, and four. And that takes our mass just about all the way back down again. Lovely. <clears throat> okay, well, we got to get her done. Okay, so let's take and pop you there. And take and pop you here. Now, um, so these have 100% light, which is interesting since, since it's overcast. But they do have 100% light, which is great. Okay, cool. Um, now, we have a little bit of a gap here, and so I'm going to redo that. Uh, I'm not going to do it right now, but I'll redo that later so it's a little more evenly spaced. All right, so let's go get our door. Uh, well, the stuff for the door. We just got to wait for those two pieces. Now, before I let you go, uh, we still have 162 nails and a bunch of boards to deal with. So let me tell you what I'm going to do with that. Um, I'm going to... We're going to make a couple of foundations to make like a little deck going on out here. So let's get those queued up. Oh, that's right. We got the triangle foundations now, too. That's... We're going to have to look at those. See what we might be able to do with those. But uh, for now, I want to make... Let's see. That is... Yeah, that's three. So let's make three of these. All right. And then while we're waiting for... Oh, wait a minute. Hold it. Stop, stop, stop. I still got to make the, the door. Oh, right. Two more glass pieces. Okay. And then we'll make... Um, those 69% light 
And there you go. The greenhouse is done for now. <laughs> uh, like I said, I will make the... Oh, you know what, though? I just thought of something. Oh, I just thought of something. We actually need... This is what I needed to make. Oh, for goodness sakes. Okay, well, that's good, though, because we only need to come up with 14 more of those. I was not thinking about that straight, and that, that's a good thing because uh, they're not going to be quite as expensive. Okay, so, yeah, I'm going to come up with 14 more pieces of glass, and we'll make the ridged roofs because that's the way I want it to look. I think it'll look nicer than just a glass box. And then these pieces, like I said, we'll, we'll repurpose those for something else. We will definitely use them for something. Um... Yeah. Okay. So let's uh, let's let's do this. So we want this to go this direction. Okay. And let's put this one out here. Except for we want it to go like that, but back this way. I think. Kind of hard to tell, actually. If I find out later that I did it wrong, that's fine. I'll just uh, change it again. Okay, so we got that. Now, um, what I want to do here is, you know, that we we run into that same issue where things don't quite line up on this corner. It would be nice to curve it around, but I, I would have to start messing around once again with the, you know, the temporary placement of the foundation kind of thing, which we can do, but I don't think we're going to do that right now. But what I want, here's what I want to do, though. I want this to wrap around. Oh, shit. <laughs> we just, we just fell off our dock. Uh, I want that to wrap around and come over this way and give us kind of like, um, um, so so have it come and maybe have a stairwell going up to the top and then have like an overhang over the top, probably like the half panels. And that's going to do two things. It's going to let me get up there and get a nice view of what's going on, long range view. But it's also going to kind of create a little bit of a lip that will further um, block the grenades and stuff that the hunters, you know, try and lob over the wall. Now... This wall does a really good job of stopping them. I'd say it stops at about 85% of the time, but every once in a while they still manage to get one actually over the wall. So if we have, you know, that little quarter panel overhang thing going on here, uh, then they'll probably almost never get one over the wall. And it gives me a, a little bit safer walkway up here to, to really look out and see what's going on. Right now I have to kind of balance on the top of this, and I sometimes fall off. So um, that's kind of what I'm going to do with... Uh, or start working on anyways with the rest of the building materials that I currently have and then when we do our next building session I think what we're gonna do is we might expand out the front of this uh, I don't think I'll expand the building now but we'll probably put a porch uh, well actually you know what we could probably do that now now that I think about it uh, that wouldn't take too long oh look at this this is gonna be like ultra super long episode but some of you will like that. Some of you might not. Some of you will. So those of you who like it, yay for you. Those of you who don't, sorry. Um, but it's just the way it worked out. <laughs> um, so my my idea here was, <clears throat> excuse me, let's make two of these and three of those, I think. And I'm just going to extend this out and make it like a nice little patio on this side, too. I don't think we need to extend the building out, at least not down here. We already have more space than we know what to do with. But what I will probably do, or, or might probably do, is do a hangover. You know, an, uh, a hangover. No, not a hangover. An overhang over on this side later. We'll see. I mean, the sky's the limit. We can do whatever we want, right? So we'll just see how things go. Um, okay, so I want you to turn this way and go like that. And I want you to turn this way. And no, go like that. 
Okay, good, good, good. And then we made three thingies, so we're gonna have to move these stairs. Let's just put that out of the way for the moment. Okay, sorry about the darkness. can go there. You can go there. And you can go there. All right. Now, what if we got to think about something here for a second? Got an idea. Let's make one of these half ceilings. Longest episode ever. <laughs> I'm not I'm not really gonna edit anything too, because we're pretty much we're doing doing stuff the whole time. So yeah, it's just gonna be a long one. All right, now, let's pop you there. Okay, you guys see where I'm going with this? And then, you know, because I don't want, like, a really big, long stairway, you know, coming all the way out here. So what we're going to do instead is we're going to put you... Oh, did I just hear hunters? Then I heard water sloshing. Maybe I stepped in the water. I don't know. All right, let's try this again. Okay, so you go there. I know that's a... Oh, no, not there. Hold on. Try this again. I couldn't... I can't see very well. There's a problem here. Um, let's pull it back. Nope. There. Okay, so we do have to do like a little jump a doodle thing here, but I mean it's not that big a deal. We can get up there. And then you, of course, we will put on this side. Nope, I did it again. Too doggone dark. I can't see what I'm doing. All right. <laughs> Not right either. Oh my goodness. What if I? Yeah, see, that's not definitely not going to come down. It means it would be sticking way out here, and that's what I don't want. I think that's correct. Okay, that's correct. All right, so we have. I mean. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we better uh, we better just do two more. We got the stuff. Let's just do it right. If we're going to do it, let's do it right. Um, but I think, you know, even if we put a foundation stairs, you know, the wide one here, it's still not going to come down far enough. And then, you know, eventually we'll put some rails around here. We'll put some rails around the other one, too. Okay, it's finally starting to get light here. There we go. Look at that. That's better. We can't do anything about this stone, unfortunately. It's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. Okay. And we still... <laughs> we still have a little bit of a step there, but you know what? I'm not going to worry about that. I really just am not going to worry about it. Okay. Cool. So, if we stand back here for a second and look at the base from here, it's coming along. The, you know, the walls that we put on the second floor uh, look kind of weird, but that, that might be temporary anyways. I don't know if we'll, we'll stick with that. Uh, but that looks pretty cool. And then if we come and look at it, can't really see a whole lot of... The window looks nice, though, from this side. But if we come out here and kind of look 
back up a little bit and look at it this way. It's coming together. Again, the walls that I put up above are kind of screwing with the aesthetic a little bit, but that's okay. It's just temporary. This is a work in progress. You know, I kind of like not having the walls covering the foundations in front. You know, I, I think they're fine along the walls themselves, but up here, I like the, the, the look of it, just leaving it like this way. And, you know, the hunters are not smart enough to come up in here. And even if they do, they're going to get stuck and we'll kill them easy anyways. So we're going to keep that look the way that it is. Um, okay. All right, you guys. Well, we need, <laughs> we need to wrap up this marathon episode. But this was a cool episode. I really had a good time, uh, you know, putting all this stuff together and just, you know, continue to look forward to expanding the base more. Uh, I'm not planning on doing anything more with this ground floor, so what we what happens next is going to be up. We're going to be going building up. Eventually, I want to have, you know, a nice tower that goes up even higher uh, so we can really see far and just continue building on things and making it look really cool here. So, oh, look at that. Um, so with that, I am going to let you guys go here. I'm going to, as usual, take a few days off and go loot and get resources replenished. Get our ingots back up because I want to. I want to get my bow upgraded to level three. That's the very next thing we're gonna work on in terms of, you know, building up to more equipment. And then uh, when I'm ready to do that, we'll probably start the next episode, and then we'll go out and test our badass tier three bow. And uh, we need to raid the hunters too. We haven't raided the hunters in a while, so uh, we're gonna have to do another day of retribution for those guys too. And, uh, you know, I'll grind up enough resources, hopefully, so we can hit all three of them in the same day, which I'm hoping will then set them back to all attacking me at the same time, which is nice because, you know, then it all happens at once and then I have a two or three days off, you know. Right now, they're kind of scattered out a little bit. In fact, I'm surprised we haven't gotten attacked already. Uh, but I need to shut up and let you guys go. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.